Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Dear brothers and sisters, welcome back to our series, People of Quran, where every night I share with you a story of one of our pious predecessors and how they interacted with the Quran. So, you know, a lot of times, you know, our pious predecessors did not come from such pious backgrounds. They had a difficult life. Um, you know, they were drinkers, they were adulterers, they were robbers at some point. And the one that we're going to share today as we move in now to our sixth juz is about a very prominent highway robber of his time whose name was Ali ibn al-Asadi, rahimahullah ta'ala. So Ali ibn al-Asadi was what's known as Qatir Tariq, a highway robber. He used to, you know, constantly steal, he used to constantly hurt people. I mean, he was, he was so bad that he was Medina's most wanted. They actually, you know, had a ransom on his head and everyone was looking for him and everybody wanted him, you know, taken out because of all the, you know, all the things that, the bad things that he'd done to that society. So Ali ibn al-Asadi is walking one day, you know, to rob somebody. And he hears a man reciting Surah Az-Zumar, verse 53. That's not the ayah we're going to be focusing on, but that's what he hears. Surah Az-Zumar, verse 53. The very famous ayah, قُلْ يَا عِبَادِيَ الَّذِينَ أَسْرَفُوا عَلَىٰ أَنفُسِهِمْ لَا تَقْنَطُوا مِنْ رَحْمَةِ اللَّهِ إِنَّ اللَّهَ يَغْفِرُ الذُّنُوبَ جَمِيعًا Say, O oh, my servants who have transgressed against themselves, do not despair from the mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Allah forgives all sins and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is all forgiving and all merciful. So he hears this man reciting that and he, re he recognizes that you know what, uh, as bad as I am, I still have a chance and I can still come back to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So he's, you know, he, he cries and he sincerely repents to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and then he makes his way to the masjid of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. And he finds Abu Huraira radiallahu ta'ala anhu. And he goes to Abu Huraira radiallahu ta'ala anhu. And he embraces Abu Huraira radiallahu ta'ala anhu. And he cries and, and he says that I've come back to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. I've made tawbah. I'm done. You know, I'm never going to go back to robbing people or anything of that sort. Now, when he comes in there and he, and, and he, and he, and he embraces Abu Huraira and he comes to pray, everyone sees him. And, you know, again, he's the most wanted in Medina at that time. You know, people want to hurt him. So people start to come close to him, to attack him. And he says to them, you're not able to touch me anymore because Allah says, and this is the ayah that we're talking about, Surah Al-Ma'idah, verse 34, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, إِلَّا لَذِينَ تَابُوا مِنْ 